Prime Minister Muhyiddin Yassin is on thin ice, according to his predecessor, Dr. Mahathir Mohamad. This is because five AMNO MPs might be convicted, while one, Najib Abdul Razak, has already been convicted and is now in the process of appealing the decision. Mahathir said if this group of MPs are disqualified, Bursatu and PN would no longer have the majority in parliament to govern. But according to Mahathir, Muhyiddin has a plan. In a blog post titled Kakiliruan or Confusion Today, Mahathir said the Prime Minister is now seeking replacements and Dr. Mahathir speculated that they may be from PKR. So far, Muhyiddin had managed to pass legislation in Parliament with the support of 111 MPs at most, while the opposition mustered no better than 109 in opposing. He also took note that Bursatu, a Bumiputra-centric party he founded in 2017, was now pivoting towards multiracialism, and yet it was pursuing membership in Muafakat National, an overtly Malay-Muslim alliance between PAS and AMNO. Mahathir alleged that Bursatu grassroots have been leaving to join his new party known as Pajuang. He said in the next election, Bursatu will not have the support of AMNO and PAS, nor Pakatan Harapan, leaving the party with little choice but perhaps to close its doors and join AMNO.